Uh, probably the first Cedar Bowl when I, uh, I kicked the field goal win with uh, 53 seconds left in the game. We kind of had a rough game at the beginning. Uh, Lebanon kind of got the jump on us. We made a few mistakes, but coming down towards the end, uh, things started to get tight. We started to come back, and then uh, with about with about uh, I'd say about three or four minutes left to go, Coach Tom Allman came up to me and said, "Hey, you might have to go in and kick a field goal." And I said, "Yeah, I know." <laughs> and he said. Uh, just keep your head down and get your foot through the ball. And I said, no sweat. And I kicked, uh, it came down to it, uh, snapped the ball. I kicked it and I looked up and like, it was the best kick I ever kicked, I believe. And, Cause it was nice and high and right through the uprights. It was really a good moment. Like they tell me like, at a, for a split se second, like when the ball was snapped, the whole place got quiet and just when when the kick was up and good, and like the whole place erupted, everything flew up in the air and like it was nuts, it just went nuts. I know we were running all around the field like <laughs> chickens with their heads cut off celebrating. And I, t I talked to like uh, former coaches that I had, uh, Dale Umberger, who's deceased, and Frank Hetrick, and every time I see Coach Hetrick, he says, uh, how long was that field goal again? And over the years, it's grown to like, I think we're up to about 80 yards by now. <laughs>